Chief of Air Staff Air Marshal Hassan Abubakar has urged newly appointed branch chiefs and air officers commanding to uphold professionalism and lead their commanders or commands to greater heights. Air Marshal Abubakar speaking at the second biannual Chief of the Air Staff's meeting with branch chiefs and air officers commanding emphasized need for unity and strategic planning to meet Nigerian Air Force's objectives. Now, ADBN's correspondent, Fumilola Ademi, has the details. Nigeria Air Force has continued to experience transition as new tactics and equipment are created to boost operational effectiveness. Chief of Air Staff highlighted induction of 12 aircraft in the past year, with 50 more expected by 2026. He urged officers to push forward with innovative leadership to meet evolving demands of national security. Our first task in this meeting is to observe, to take stock of our current situation using accurate data and reliable feedback. Once we have gathered all necessary information, the next step is to orient ourselves by aligning the key drivers of my command philosophy with the prevailing challenges and current realities in the field. Now, with a clear understanding of our situation, we move to decide. Decisions reached at this forum must be grounded in sound judgment and a firm grasp of our objectives. Finally, we reach the point where we act. Plants, gentlemen, are only as good as the execution. And once we have charted our course at the end of these two days, we must ensure that every institution, directorate, and unit under our command is aligned to the directives we issue from here. Operational successes in Northwest and South South regions were acknowledged with a focus on counterinsurgency and anti oil theft operations. The Air Chief, however, emphasized need for continuous improvement in using air power for national security. Let us remember that in the heat of battle, victory smiles only on the faces of those that can complete their order loop faster and more effectively than their adversaries. The two-day meeting is geared towards enabling in-depth decisions that would lead to far-reaching resolutions to move Nigeria Air Force forward. From Lola Adeyemi, ADPN News.